Welcome back to my channel, my name is Nana and today we're playing some more Sims for Seasons. This is the official and final episode of the Sims 4 Seasons before we start a completely new let's play in the Sims 4 Get Famous and we'll be continuing with this family and Cassie in particular which I'm really excited for so if you guys are excited and interested to see the next chapter in Cassie's life and in Savannah's life then please do check out the following videos that will be uploaded this week. Sleeping very peacefully right now and the wedding is in a couple of days. I do have work in about 11 hours so I'm hoping that I can get to level 9 and then in the second day so tomorrow well I guess the day after tomorrow I want to see if I can get to level 10 because that would be perfect we did exactly everything that I wanted to do and everything that came with the you know the seasons you know the seasons expansion pack and I think that's the perfect way to end things I, there is of course a second road to take with the career you can either be i think a botanist or a f simple flowers um or maybe botanist is the one with flowers i'm not exactly sure but of course we only took one of the roads so it's not a hundred percent playthrough but uh, i think i pretty much covered all aspects now poor old salem actually has gotten himself abducted now I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I have never ever seen this before. This is the first time I've ever seen. I decided to start this let's be a little bit earlier because I thought, well, you know what? It might be fun to just, you know, to, to experience this with you guys. Like, oh my god. Oh my god. Sept and Jolted. Whatever those aliens did really messed with my head. Oh my god. Are they gone now? Oh, and they're gone already. Oh wait, wait, wait. Don't 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 go that fast. I guess I just lost my opportunity to see if I um, did anything to the poor old Salem. Imagine if he's pregnant. Oh my god, imagine. But I think he should be fine. I don't, I've never had anything like this, never experienced anything like this, but I wanted, I thought it might be, you know, fun for once. So I'm just kind of, you know, take, take you guys along this new experience. But fortunately, there's not much to it. You just, <laughs> you just get zapped in and zipped out. Now, as for Salem, Salem is currently in level 9 of the career, and I don't necessarily want him to complete this uh, in this let's play, but I think to kind of round things up, I think he deserves to, um, you know, to round this up, um, I think he deserves to reach the top of his career. He's been working really hard and you know he's very ambitious as well he's starting to become really serious about this job of him and he loves writing and all of that so i feel like since he you know finished his aspiration i think it'll be nice for him to um get the top of his career and um then he's just like a professional writer and i'm not exactly sure if that means like with maybe the new get famous career he can be an actual writer or something i don't know if he would actually love that because he might get in the spotlights a lot but i guess we'll cross that road when we get there um but i i kind of feel like it it will make sense to kind of round things up so he has work in three hours because he's working four hours so we're gonna have him get us some breakfast for this morning so this this is <laughs> wow talking you know what you would think after 20 parts almost well there's more parts about it this place but it is one particular you would think after 20 episodes let's have some french toast but a to toast not a friend french toast a french toast uh, you would think after 20 episodes my speech would improve you would think it would improve just maybe a little bit but no 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 no, no. i still speak as poorly as i did before so this episode might be a little on the long side i'm not sure how much um you know how long it's going to be but since it's the last episode i kind of do want to get the full potential from it and um end it in a way that i feel like is a pro have some breakfast since salem i made all that for us wow he might okay oh, for a second i was like oh my god are you eating toast he's eating he's eating bread with a fork that that has me triggered that has me triggered so bad salem how could you do that to me how could you do that oh my god and a lot of time with dina and lilith and on like um we went, i think we went to the gym together uh which is something we all like everyone in the group loves working out which is like perfect that's the thing we bond over i suppose so we're kind of good friends now so i don't feel as bad as inviting them over to the wedding first time i have seen rain here in oasis springs which 
I thought was not possible. I thought it was not possible to have rain, but it does rain here, which is really nice. Maybe it's just a little uncommon, but it's really nice to. Ooh, it's really nice to see some rain instead of just sun. Whom should the paper endorse for political office? It's Salem's call. She can either select the popular idealist who has no chance of winning, or he can select the incumbent candidate who attends more fundraisers and cocktail parties than meeting when constituents. Okay. Of such a prestigious paper has put new life in the idealist campaign. She might just win after all. Probably not really, but still. Hooray for principles. Okay. Certainly do have to um, kind of work our butts off these last couple of days. Turn off. And yes, in fact, if you're wondering, I think Cassie is going to quit her job after she reaches the top, which is kind of defeats the purpose. But honestly, this is not her dream job. This is her hobby. It's not her dream job. She just saw this as an opportunity to have a stable income doing something she likes, but it's not something she loves. So obviously she's going to just quit this job later on. Also, her cow plan died, which is very unfortunate. I just forgot to feed him like once and boom, he's dead. <laughs> it's like me, forget to feed me once. I'm just like <laughs> knock, knocked out. Unfortunately, there is no promotion for Salem. But... But at least we tried. Not a promotion. Wow, it's really hard to get a promotion. Oh my god. I think we'll definitely get one in the next um, tomorrow. But our wedding is coming up soon. So <laughs> it's going to be close. Found a plan to evolve as well. So let's see if it finally works or not. Which one was it? This one? No, maybe that one. Where is it? I could have sworn I saw a plan that could be evolved. Where is it? hiding somewhere isn't it oh my god it's hiding somewhere <laughs> which one was it? oh there it is okay this one do you see that it did not go up whatsoever so uh, i think this is all approved um like i said wait is it snowing hold up it's snowing here in oasis springs that's odd Anyway, I think, um, see, let's see, let's try it again, evolve that one. See, it's not working whatsoever, so, um, hope you guys can bear with me and allow me to kind of cheat on this. So, um, age adult, 6 out of 9, what does this mean? Age 6 out of 96. Interesting, anyway, <laughs> let's go over to complete aspiration goal there we go we finished this aspiration complete cassie has grown and spliced every veritable 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 imaginable and finally her dream of becoming a freelance botanist is complete trade earn naturalist sim is fireproof gosh damn cassie she is a boss a boss i tell you that so let's check out our new trait that comes with this since they are naturalist, don't need to fear fire. It won't touch them and they can extinguish it with ease. So that's all pretty much there is. Oh my gosh. She has a couple of these. Do you see how many she has? Oh my gosh. She's very, very talented. Anyway, uh, that means we finished the botanist um, aspiration, which is, is, which is really good, which is really, really nice. I'm really happy about that. Um, like I said, I don't want to do the one with the flower making. Um, I actually got rid of it as well. It's just not something she enjoys. She never does it and she doesn't care about it. So I'm not going to force her to do that if she doesn't, you know, if she clearly doesn't have a love for that. Wedding is tomorrow and the weather tonight is really bad. It's raining. It's thundering. It's really not the ideal weather if I say so myself, but hopefully it's going to clear up as much as I love thunder and rain and all that, which I, I honestly do and I think Cassie does as well. I think Cassie also really likes to you know, have just like a bunch of snow and things, but not on their wedding day. That's gonna be a little cold. See, it's like I'm just gonna go and do my run in the middle of the night <laughs> in a thunderstorm with rain with my umbrella. Why not? This is so typical Cassie. She really does not care. Lilith rather stayed indoors, which I can totally understand, but Cassie just really needs to like blow off some of the steam. He's never worried about what it looks like. 
until today. All of a sudden, he was sleeping and awoken by his own thoughts. Like, oh my god, what am I gonna put on? What am I gonna wear? Cassio on the other hand, on all the worries off, and now she's in bed sleeping. Well, Salem is practicing his his vow. Hey, why is Betty running away? Oh my god. The thunder. Oh no. She was so scared of thunder that she ran away. Oh my god. No, Betty, come back. We love you. Come back, Betty. No. Oh my Cassie has woken up with <laughs> with some nerves and a little bit of sadness because she can't find Betty. She's trying to give herself a pep talk in the mirror. We're gonna have her freshen herself up a little bit. She has some things planned for today that she wants to go and do, like get her nails done, all of that. Have her take um, a sing in the shower. We're really happy though. As much as we're nervous, we're really, really happy and we can't wait to get married to this man. I've been thinking about the last name situation, so Cassie is called Cassie Flirty, and Salem is Salem Banali or Salim Banali. Depends how you want to say it. Um, think twice about that. She's not the type that just wants men to become, you know, the new. Th how I put it, she doesn't want everything to evolve. To revolve, she doesn't want things to re revolve, re revolve, revolve. Why is it such a weird word now? Revolve. <laughs> she doesn't want things to be about men always. She's like, why not? Why can't men have our last name? Why do we need to give up our last name? So she's really thinking about that situation, and we might just get it changed to Cassie Flirty Banali, but um to kind of keep her own last name or we're gonna have salem take our name so it's gonna be Sally, Sally, salem banali flirties you know what i actually kind of like that i like the idea of um we'll see we'll see what's gonna be we'll see what's gonna be i have to figure that, i've yet to figure that out cassie is getting ready to do all of her duties so she's getting her makeup done she's getting her pores checked she's getting her nails done all of that and then she's gonna come back home and change while Salem is out so the two of them are in oh my god oh no oh no I thought he looked fat oh no he didn't look fat but I mean it looked like he had beer belly no he's pregnant oh no oh my god hold up hold your horses oh no okay um this is okay. Why don't we just have him get and go in? Oh my god. This, this, this is not happening really. We can just, we can get it, we can kind of end it though. One male and a female baby. Partner, senior, pollination, technician, three. I kind of am interested, interested to see what it would be like, but I'm definitely not going to keep it. So let's just say we're not showing. Um, Oh my god, like honestly, why do we have to be pregnant? That, that's not okay. That's really not okay. We're not gonna eat your wedding cake, okay? So uh, while Cassie's out, Salem is gonna just kind of prepare himself over here. So he's gonna freshen up, kind of repeat his speech just a little bit. We have about four hours. No, no, six hours. Sorry, I can't count. Can't count Um, And there's no news about Betty yet. I don't think at least she's not back home. Which is kind of sad, but you know, it's just how it's going to be. Oh, Betty has returned. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Where, where is she? Where is she? Oh my god. Imagine she hasn't returned. I would have been so upset. I would have been so... Oh my gosh. She's so dirty. I really, really, really would have been super upset. Oh my gosh. I'm so happy that she's back. And Cassie can now get into the wedding and just enjoy it fully. Imagine her little kitty would have been gone oh my god oh you're so so weird no oh, i missed i missed i missed my little buddy so much all right let's get these two up in their outfits so this one is currently wearing but i had a feeling he might want to put on something a little bit more traditional now, i don't exactly know what ethnicity salem would be but he had this kind of clothing on him when i first met him and I have a feeling like this must be something very traditional. I really like it, but there's no white, white, white. If there was a completely white one, okay, if there was a completely white one, I would have taken it, but oh my god, you're pregos, dude. I'm not okay with this. Why did you have to become pregos? Seriously, pregos on his flipping wedding day, honestly, can you imagine? As for Cassie, this is the dress that we picked. 
and i wonder if she has any shoes on it doesn't look like it so we're gonna have her put on some shoes just put on something really comfortable because we're gonna be wearing it quite all day something like that would be nice and then i want to give her a veil as well where's the veil? there it is oh she, oh that looks so good she looks so cute oh i cannot believe my babies are getting married let's put on some makeup so let's see what kind of makeup do you think she got done at the place and maybe not like that i i think she got something dramatic but not super dramatic oh i love that i love that and then maybe some eyeliner something that she probably would never wear herself i think that's usually what you know kind of makeup you have it's just something that looks really good in photos so i think i'm like i have never been married but i think you would get some makeup that would look really good in photos um and something you probably never would wear on yourself <laughs> just because you don't want to look like yourself and you're running day you want to trick him no just kidding um uh, i really like this lip gloss let's put this on as well oh my god she looks perfect but i don't know if i like this maybe she needs some curls don't we think she needs some curls Mm, i want things to be perfect right we do really want to be things to be perfect this is the outfit you guys doesn't she look gorgeous let's see if we can find some some accessories maybe something for her arms or something like a nice i don't know if i would think a necklace <gasps> that looks maybe a little overdone hmm those earrings i mean i love them under but maybe not for her wedding so let's make it something a little Where's the other ones that I really, really like? There are some small ones that are absolutely super pretty. That I really, really, really like like these ones, I think. Yeah, those. There we go. That looks really nice. Um, okay. Nose piercing. I, it's... I don't know. I... Hmm. Okay. I think this might be the only occasion we're going to take off our nose ring just because... Oh my god, she looks so weird without it because I just want her to have... You know, just show her face the best as we can. And let me see. Let's just, maybe just a bracelet. Let's see if we can bra add a bracelet. Let's see if we can fancy this up to do some nails though. There we go. Oh, doesn't look like good. Anyway, I think that is all. All right, it is time to get married can you imagine all the guests are already up and sitting i guess they're not standing they're sitting it's about time that they're getting married and instead of her own dad savannah's dad is actually gonna give her away and i think this is such a special moment because obviously cassie doesn't have her parents anymore and i love how she's just looking at savannah like i'm gonna get married and oh my god like oh my god i have honestly i have goosebumps just because i'm literally so excited that she's gonna get married and her her own dad is like oh, oh. Uh, and he's actually walking her down the aisle. That's so cute. He's walking her down. Oh my god. Her, I swear her friend's dad is just... Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm gonna say, oh my god. Like way, way, way too much. Salem is down for this. He's like, girl, I'm gonna sit here. I'm gonna wait here. Come and marry me, mama. No, I don't actually think he would say, come and get me, mama. But you know what I mean. You know what I mean. Oh my god. Okay, maybe the backdrop is not perfect but oh my god oh my god oh my god i'm gonna say oh my god all the time this is honestly the cutest oh my gosh suit that i put him in which is a little disappointing because i want him to be completely in white but whatever we're gonna have to deal with it right there's there's nothing else we can do about that can we actually like stop marrying stop the marriage and just like change your outfit could that is that a thing i'm so extra i actually had them stop the wedding to get the right suit on oh my god Oh my god, I'm gonna say oh my god so much. This is literally not normal. <gasps> what a beautiful ceremony. Cassie's exchanging her vows with Salem. I'm getting way too excited for this. This is absolutely not normal. This is not normal. I'm too excited for this. I'm way too excited for two virtual sims to get married. This is this is really abnormal. She's like, with this ring, I take you to be my Salem. <laughs> oh, they're married. Oh my god god how i love how paolo and Sven are like kissing like you're next man you're next just the way our wedding is going to be ginormous such a 
special little moment. Oh my god, everyone's eating the cake. Oh my god. I love I love how we have created this entire family. Well, a year ago, the two girls were just alone. There's nobody. Oh my god, I'm honestly excited. This is honestly the best. I love how diverse the entire group is as well. There's just so many people from all ethnicities, from all backgrounds, just together. It looks like he's... Oh, he's upset. What could he possibly be upset the entertainment for tonight? And she's... She's just... She's amazing. one that is so grown she looks so mature right now she really does suit her age she really really does i'm just honestly blown away by everything this day could not have been more perfect than it already is perfect i think everyone is just having the best time ever salem is just all in awe over this little girl and i i think that he's just like imagining himself to be a dad one day and he's like I wonder what it's like to, you know, take the next step. Because definitely the next step for him would be kids. And that's a whole nother story. That's a whole nother chapter in this guy's, you know, in the guy's life. So I do want to get a good. So I'm going to have um, Cassie order a drink as well. Uh, I think people are, they might just be coming to drink. No, they're not. So we're going to have him get a drink as well. Just, um just because i really do want to get it perfect so we just have to have one more drink and then we're done Are you drunk and what it is oh my god poor salem look at that look how much there is just married the promise of a lifetime of companionship would make any sim happy and that should be the last part come on come on come on come on come on hey can't you please drink this i really am trying to get it perfect mm -mm. there's always something uh, I guess we almost made it. I guess the party's over now and everyone's gonna go and get, you know, get home. Um, I think, oh, we better have her go to the bathroom real quick. Uh, I think this was such an accomplished and successful party. It looks like both Cassie and Salem are drunk and we know what happens when people are drunk, so they better not sleep in the same bed tonight. Cassie, Cassie's just like, oh, Savannah looks sick a little bit. Oh my god, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, oh my god, I'm just, mm. This will forever be the day that Cassie peed herself on her wedding day because she was so drunk, she couldn't keep it in anymore. <laughs> so that should have been the end, but I am stubborn and I really, really wanted to get two things done. I wanted this promotion to happen, which didn't happen, Sam the Duncan a promotion. But I am, um, he's pregnant and I am really curious what an alien, you know, an alien, the birth looks like for a man, which that's, it, it looks a little weird, a little bit weird. Um, but I'm just really like into, I don't know, like I just wanted to see what this happened. So we're just gonna end it with like alien birth and hopefully Cassie getting a promotion. She's level nine now, so we need one more. She's getting off in about two hours so hopefully we get a promotion he's thinking i think he's like this must be a bad dream this must be a bad dream what is coming out of me <laughs> oh absolutely devastated okay well you guys i think i did well enough <laughs> and um she's definitely you know she's definitely up for a promotion so why don't we just like end this all i know you're gonna be like well, you're, 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 you're cheating uh, we're gonna just doesn't matter anyway it doesn't matter anyway because we already finished the last play all right let's see what the last stage is like cassie's been promoted to phd of pollen she will not make additional 320 blemish blossom so what does that exactly do uh, was it any oh it wasn't anything in here okay that's just her name the name of her job i guess blemish blossom whatever whatevs anyway we did that we got the top of the career can we like it would be kind of funny can we can we like touch his belly perhaps Oh my god, I like she's freaking out. She's like, the baby's coming, the baby's coming. Can we feel his baby? This is this is this is weird. Pre-parental panic. It's not your baby though. <laughs> I always say when we're pregnant with your baby. This is this is just is weird. This is weird, you guys. This is the weirdest thing I've seen in a long time. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, he's purple. Oh no, it's it's purple. It was kind of cute, but oh my god, it's purple. 
Oh, I like how he's like, I, I'm a bond. I'm a, I'm a daddy now. I am a daddy. Very special delivery. Have a male sim give birth to an alien. Well, that's something I'm never ever gonna do again. He's so cute. <laughs> send. You can send him to Homeworld. Oh, oh my God. Okay, you know what? Let's, Cassie, come here. We let's witness this. We're gonna witness this baby and send him back right where it came from. <laughs> so sad i like how salem is like this did not happen this did not happen did, did this baby did not just come out of my butt this did did, did this not happen did did didn't happen oh my god beat him just 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 uh, do some bonding and then we're gonna send him back to his home world there goes little i wonder what it would look like i wonder maybe he's actually kind of cute like you don't know you know he could grow up like really really cute to be fair to be fair, that is a really cute baby. To be fair, like I'm not even joking. That is a cute baby. That that's very cute. We're just gonna send him out. Bye bye, my baby. Come on, Cassie, come here. Say goodbye. Are you sure you want to send Mauricio back to his home planet? Communication between Earth and 6M are impossible. Our relationship, our relations with this baby will be severed, and he will be permanently removed from the household. I don't feel bad, but sorry. Bye, Mauricio. Not. Bye bye. Oh my god. Anyway, guys, this is the official last episode. <laughs> I want to thank you guys so much for being with me in this let's play and sitting through this entire season. This was a fun let's play to do, and I hope you guys will tune in for the next one that I will do pretty soon this week. And we're gonna start over, same sims, different storyline. This is gonna be exciting. I want to thank you guys so 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 much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.